like we're doing the show for the Pro Bowl. Yeah. And then in the booth Bowie for... Bowie invite from Asheville, North Carolina. There you go. There you Mali go. Maliki Maka, my friends. <laughs> Merry Christmas to everyone out there. So <laughs> Matthews. 20, 10, 5, boom shakalaka! Touchdown, St. Mary! Maybe not quite on par with Shaq for one name recognition, but for followers of local sports in West Central Ohio, one name is all they needed to recognize Aaron Matthews. We're glad to be back to work here with high school football, Doug. It's a little steamy, isn't it? Run the draw. Mullen down to the six-yard line. Stays on his feet. Driven out of bounds. No, did he get in? Yes. Touchdown, Wapakoneta. Great run. Save that one. The big man with the big voice, big personality, and big heart passed away on December 20th after a battle with COVID. Matthews spent over 20 years in the field of broadcasting, making his way from Logansport, Indiana to Lima, Ohio. Getting a start in radio, Matthews was heralded as the voice of LCC during the Thunderbirds basketball title runs in the last decade. Aaron knew every athlete in this building for about 10 years because he was the voice of the T-Birds. And, you know, as voice of T-Birds, he really embodied what Lima, Lima Central Catholic was. I wouldn't say he was in my circle friends. He was in my corner of friends. Like, he, I just always felt like Aaron always had my back. While in radio still, Aaron began to transition to TV becoming a contributor to WOSN a year after its 2010 startup. Those five um, guards, are when they go with the five guard set, it's a combination of guys that they can go with. Um, they're pretty fun. Aaron was more than an announcer. He was an advocate, a champion for local athletes. Aaron made sure that every school, and that's not only Perry, but some of the schools that didn't get much publicity, he made sure he got out to those schools because he was advocate for all the kids. I was unsure if Perry could make it to a regional, and he was always that positive person in my ear. And everything he did, he went all out. Any extra miles were all covered, and then some. It was a brotherly love, and, and I'm generally going to miss that guy because of, of the passion that he gave so many people, and just his, his heart and, and his, just his energy is definitely going to be missed. Aaron's legacy will reverberate for many years, on and off the airwaves. Aaron Matthews was 43 years old.